it's not working, so we, we can't go any further. It's the moment we've all been waiting for. You don't want it to lift, so that is a problem. The entire house is bubbling, and it's not just like one little area. I just don't think we can sit here any longer. I think we need to start making a move. Two years ago, we purchased this abandoned cabin with the goal of transforming it into the homestead of our dreams. And so far, we've taken it from dark, overgrown, and unloved to an off-grid oasis with running water and solar electricity. Over the past few weeks, we have been on a mission to transform the exterior, but it's been a bit of a struggle. Will all our hard work be for nothing? Morning. Morning. You're sprawled, eh? You're sprawled, Bella, Bella, Bella. We met at midday. Are you awake? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> you love it? I oh, love it. It's so nice. It is so nice. Good morning. <laughs> That's the energetic good morning because nothing beats a very cold well shower first thing in the morning. Double fist in this morning. All right, everyone. Last week when we tried to side our house, we were in a storm. Honestly, it never ends. No. Hence, it didn't really work out. Now we're trying to side the house and we're in a heat wave. Anyways, I would take siding a house in a heat wave any day. I'm just so happy the sun's out that I don't even care. Check back with me at two and let you know if I care. Mostly are done under the windows. And now I think the game plan for the top, I've done a few two pieces. I'm going to cut a bunch of long ones in their designated areas. And then I will fill in the blanks at the bottom after, just like this. So that's one full piece all the way up. And then there's a cut piece that I've just married right down there. This look is huh? heat wave look. Strapping is making, I mean, blue skin is making strapping look incredibly easy. Just a couple pieces up on a wall. Before we can start strapping this side, we have to seal around our windows with the blue skin. We use this, is it Resito? Resetto? Resisto! Technically, we have to do a second layer anyways over it. That is perfectly caulked and watertight. So we're gonna use our good friend, Henry Blueskin. After many setbacks, could this be the week we get our siding on? Fingers crossed, it all goes to plan. No! no! Our nail gun's broken! Our nail gun's broken. All right, well, I'm about to have a meltdown, so. What? <laughs> like, this is just, it's not working. Like, this blue skin isn't working. And it's coming off. <laughs> What was going very well and what was very close to siding currently is no longer and I'm feeling super defeated because as I'm looking at the blue skin around the house, the heat is hitting it and it seems to be bubbling out as if it's not adhered the way it's supposed to, whether that be because there wasn't enough paint or it wasn't pressed down enough. Whatever it may be, which we're trying to figure out right now is Obviously not good because we're done the whole house now. And why it's so terrible is because we use blue skin that if water does get in, that like a little pocket of where it is or forms, it has nowhere to escape. Where Tyvex, when you put it on, you're just stapling it. Moisture gets in, has it has room to breathe. This stuff doesn't really have 
any breathing room, it's not working. So we, we can't go any further due to the fact that if moisture does get caught in these little air gaps, then our house will basically rot. It's only bad if you get water in it. That's when the problem uh, starts. If you water in it, then my friend, you have to cut it open and put a patch on it. He's probably not realizing that like the entire house is bubbling and it's not just like one little area. That's the thing that it's already like, already bubbled. The thing now is you have to get the strapping on fast because you don't want all this bubble uh, bubbling to happen. That's our friend. He has his own construction business in Ontario. Just the big jobs. What Altair doesn't know is that our nail gun just broke. We need a bigger roller to press it all down. We need two so we can both go at the same time. And we live an hour away from the store, then an hour back. So it's gonna be three hours. So it's a whole day. A whole day. Going back, probably would have not used blue skin, would have used literally anything else. And the only reason why is because I thought there'd be less room for air, but there just seems to be more room for air. So it's probably gonna all be fine. Like it will be fine. It's just gonna be more work and more time. That's it. Right? And hopefully it works out. Lifting is a problem. You don't want it to lift, so that is a problem. That's that you don't want at all. <sighs> it definitely is super defeating. After spending weeks on this, it is obviously frustrating because we might have to rip it all down or we might have to go and roll even harder or cut out pouches and put adhesive on it and all of that, but I personally want to rip it down. I know that might sound like crazy to a lot of you, but I don't know when something is going to be in the back of your mind and you're going to think like, how is that doing? Like, what is the point? So now you understand why I don't like putting, uh, <laughs> or I would never put blue skin on a house. So now you finally get what I was trying to tell you the other day. LOL, Altair, LOL. Yeah, we get it now. We are like, we are told it's a superior product. We're gonna restart our day, I like that. Seems like the best plan, right? <laughs> so you're gonna restart your day? Yeah, have a coffee, have another cold shower, and get back to work. I think the best thing we can do is spend every minute that we have left at the cabin putting, pushing it down and putting up the strapping and then that's it. Like, I don't think we should move on to the siding. I think we should just focus on getting every wall sealed. I just don't think it's realistic. Like, I was excited to start the siding and show everyone, and like, I'm so excited about it, but it truly doesn't make sense. Like, I think every single side needs to be strapped and ready. Uh, you will have bubbling just because you, you have the hot sun, like you said in your message, you know, hitting the surface. And if you have a little bit of an air pocket, it will just create a bubble, right? Um, don't worry so much about that. Thank goodness that <laughs> Aldera got back to us. Gotta love friends who are in the industry and know what they're doing. Altair has been working construction forever. And that was a huge relief to hear that everything is fine, <laughs> that we can roll out these air bubbles and move on because it happens all the time in even commercial construction. So people that have been doing this job for the last 30 years. years. <laughs> <laughs> I just like get really into these projects and like that was like destructive for me to look. Did you also hear Tia? I was not well. <laughs> Anyways, Jasmine's leaving. She's going to get us a massive heavy duty vinyl roller so we can roll this blue skin back on because it's going to be fine. It's going to stick. I just need some work and everything's gonna be fine and I can now breathe again. <laughs> I'm off. Ciao. You want a burrito when I come back, girl? Sure. I know the way to your heart. She <laughs> surprised you. Just the van wide. No, it's not HGTV. Just the two of us. We are the construction workers. But if anyone wants a job, I'm looking to hire a construction crew. Seems like it works out well. Woo! There's no better way to start your day than with an AG1. And that includes when you're restarting your day. So let's hit it.
It makes getting the most fundamental nutrients for your body so simple and convenient. They even have travel packs for when you're on the move. And a huge thank you to our sponsor for offering 10 free travel packs and a one year supply of a vitamin D dropper to you with your first purchase. Use our link in our description to access this offer. Your body will thank you. There are a whole slew of benefits with AG1, such as increased immunity, gut health, focused recovery levels, energy. It is truly such peace of mind knowing that with one simple scoop, your body has everything it needs. We've been taking AG1 for so many years. We love being able to share it with you. And when we're out here working on the homestead, it is an absolute essential. It's absolutely true that you can push all of those supplement bottles to the side. As they say, you're gonna need a smaller cupboard because AG1 is jam packed. All of their ingredients are online and you will be blown away by how it makes you feel. It covers all of your bases. That was the refresh that I needed. And we're off with an ice cold bubbly in hand. One hour to go. Imagine I made you all drive the full hour with me on YouTube. How many of you would click off? <laughs> okay, ready, set, drive super fast, Jasmine, and go. One thing and one thing only. Got it. Fancy meeting all of you in here. Off to win partner of the year. Wow, there's no line. Things are looking up. <laughs> I'm feeling a lot more optimistic. Sweat my butt off cutting the rest of the strapping for this side. Jasmine's coming home with the burritos. Everything's gonna be good with the blue skin. Life couldn't be better, honestly. So things just don't always go to plan. And although for a second I had a bad way of dealing with it, <laughs> it's gonna be fine. And I think it's absolutely the coolest thing <clears throat> that we bring you along for all of the ups and downs and really, really just bring you along for our raw life and our true selves so much of the time showing exactly who we are how jasmine and i are um our true interactions and the reality of certain projects of this size and just even yeah just life you know i think it's the coolest thing um because if we didn't share all of those pieces it wouldn't be the full puzzle <laughs> Hey, did you get the nail gun? Oh my god! I had a feeling you forgot. See you when you get Thanks home. Thanks for reminding me. Okay. <laughs> I would have literally just used a hammer. Yeah, that would have sucked. It's all sold out, but... Spent way too long <laughs> wrestling with this nail gun, trying to figure it out. It's suddenly not working. Kinda hard to believe. <laughs> Hi. Hello? How's it going? Hi. I love you too. <laughs> this plate is it. Jasmine literally went to the hardware store to get that roller and a new nail gun because it was acting up. It's good because they didn't have any in stock and ours is working now. Woo! Coffee number two. <laughs> Can't believe I'm even asking that. Cold all day, baby. I even jumped back in the outdoor shower to cool off because we gotta keep this train moving. Jazzy's gonna be here in maybe 15, 20 minutes. We still have a lot of daylight left, so let's do it. Is that mama? Is that mama? <laughs> oh my goodness, hello. Welcome home. Three, two, one, roll! It's time to rock and roll, quite literally. Wow, that coffee? <laughs> My life saver. Wow, that coffee has me so hyped. I love it. I know, it's all melty. That's what I'm saying, because it's sign. Maybe it says, do not use if very hot out. It's really hot. The caulking seems very weird, and we have to caulk around the windows in order to start strapping it and siding it. Should we wait to do this side? I think it's fine. 
It should be chop chop like liver. Like chop chop like liver. Chop chop like liver it is, y'all. Wow, it's so hot. I love it. Yeah. Remember that rain we just got? I hate blue skin. Let me tell you that. I'm so over it. Let me tell y'all. I'm going on vacation after this. I only could have told me a week ago how brutal this would have been. Remember how excited we were like, oh, this reminds us of the cabin season one. Like, it's so fun. There's the two of us. So excited for this project. Thank you both. So exciting. This is so easy. Look how cool this is. It's like duct taping your whole house. Who would want to do that? No one. Use Tyvex, people. <laughs> LOL, Henry. Well, we made it this far in the process with a few bumps in the road, but we are nearing the finish line. Shwetting. Oh, no, no, no. I will block you. Yo, get me off here. Do us, do to me. I'm beat. I know. Ew, like I'm actually dripping. You know what I think should go on textbooks? When you're having a bad day, restart your day. Copy in a cold jar. I think it was really nice. I don't say girl. Almost there. I know girl. we have a backside, but I'm pretending the backside of my yeah, house doesn't I don't exist. I know why you keep doing that. But I don't see it. Crazy. Every shot I take is from this end. <laughs> okay, as much as I'm pretending I don't have a bag of my house, I'm not allowed to pretend anymore. Boss says, Got to get it cocked and strapped. Well, cocked and rolled. Maybe strapped. We'll see. However, there is a problem. We're short AF. So, um, still looking for someone tall to come on over. I also have to rent a genie boom, which is pretty silly for one piece. But it's also not silly because then, well, I don't fall off and break my neck. Supervisor Bella told us we're not allowed to do it. No way, moms. I like having two moms, she said. Three, two, one. Donzo! Look at that, y'all. Literally just had enough caulking. Oh my god, my, it just fell out of my hand. It's so broken. <laughs> Hello? Great choice of spot. Hello? So I got two meals. I got the veggie crunch tacos with corn tortillas. And we all saw Crystal's big burrito being made. Mm. I can't believe one time, I thought we were gonna do the siding and waterproofing in one video. L-O-L. -L. I tried to tell you that it was gonna take us a month. Waterproofing, take a day. Do you remember that? Oh, it was gonna take one week to paint, one week to blue skin, one week to strap. What's wrong with me? I just know that like as a newbie, everything takes twice as long and then you're filming. And then if you run out of something, the hardware store is too far away. How many trips have gone to the hardware store? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. We need to chomp chomp and then clean up the yard. Because guess what everyone? A special someone just texted us saying, looks like it's finally sunny. I'll see you tomorrow. Class around the city. Lovers come and go Partners out the pretty Wonder up my room I can't hear them whisper Simple words of play I can't hear them whisper Simple words that Does it ever feel nice to have a quiet, clean space? Wow, it's probably been a month since our porch and our deck have look like this and I love it. We're having a little burn now on our dirt front yard and it's just remind me of cabin season one so much. Lights are on in the greenhouse. Let's go see what the little lady's up to. Magic. Oh, scare me. Sorry, what are you doing over here, little lady? I'm fertilizing. Oh my gosh, it's what are you doing with the hose over here? Water. Everything's doing so wonderful in here, everyone. We have kale. Just a little update. Look at the basil, she's growing. And I just did pick that basil the other day because I made a pesto pasta. Summer's back, everyone. I love summer nights. This is perfect. It's the moment we've all been waiting for. Porter! 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 Porter!
Porter. They're gonna be so excited. Is that your best friend? Is that Porter? That's Porter. That's Porter. <laughs> Morning. Porter's back. <laughs> we are tackling the project of leveling out our front yard and the side of the cabin and working on getting that drainage and that easy slope into the woods so that way the water can run away. It is now dry enough that he can have his machine here. I'm just beyond thrilled. We've all missed Porter. I know you've all missed Porter. <laughs> Things are getting done, finally. What a good feeling. And while Porter gets leveling, you're probably wondering, what is Jasmine doing with all that rock? Well, we have a French drain there. Stone allows the water to irrigate through it into the French drain and run away from the cabin, so. That thing is so fast. Okay. Wow, that just got done so fast and it <laughs> looks like Porter's just pulled over. He needs some grease. We're gonna do some greasing of the excavator and it looks like he's gonna help Jasmine. <laughs> what a gem. You wanna do my machine? Yeah! Clementine's getting greased finally. Whoa. You put it inside? You learning? We need this! I've been going around in the tractor and just thinking how much I love watching machines. Like, do you see the excavator? Do you see how flat that is and perfect and there's like no rocks? Excavators are like a whole different breed. Thank you, Porter! I'll be back in 10 hours! 10 hours! I'm happened at Jasmine. Why? Because she was just smearing it on and you gotta actually get it in the pit. What a newbie! Yep, you said it. It's so nice to see Porter back. We tried to do the strapping, but we can't resist watching the best show in the woods. I run a lot fitness, can't believe this moment. I'm free. How do you strap when there's an excavator in your yard? How'd you get so good at excavating? I don't know. <laughs> Looks so good. Hi, Larry. All right, we're making good progress over here. Wondering if you could bring another load of fill. I got it on the truck right now. I'll leave in a few minutes. Awesome. Thanks so much. All right. Okay, see you soon. Order in line. Yeah. All right, Larry is back for another load of fill, y'all. And I don't know if anyone's noticed, but the yard is going to be basically tripling in size. So the idea is that we're going to level it off with the driveway and a gradual slope into the tree line, into the forest. That way we won't have any more flooding. Even on summer days it was happening, not gonna lie. It was just never drying. So we'll have a nice, lush, dry lawn after this. Not only is it gonna be tripling that way and the yard going underneath the panels, it's like gardens and all of that jazz. We're still designing that. So if you have any ideas on how we should design underneath the panels, let us know in the comments. We'd greatly appreciate it. We already have a few of our patrons giving us a few ideas in our texting group chat. You should join that if you haven't already. Patreon.com forward slash fanwives. And we text the roo. It's like real life updates. And the yard is also going to be going through the left side of the house. So over there, wrapping around the back, over to here. Porter just turned off his excavator <laughs> to let Crystal and I know that it's scary working underneath the panels. He is literally like this close in the panels. Oh my goodness, I'm freaking out. It's better not to look. Whew. They're just so delicate, they'll just crack, right? The excavator's so strong, oh my goodness. He's freaking me out. I think he's more freaked out than us, let's be real. He's the one doing the job. What we want though is the ground to level up right to that pole so you don't see any of the cement or anything. It's just gonna look phenomenal. I'm envisioning it right now. Are you? No, I can't think of out. anything other than the fact that he's underneath the solar array right now. <laughs> Freaking me out, I can't watch. Nice! I'll go up there, no problem. Okay. I'm gonna go get the blue skin then. Okay, I can't believe it everyone. I'm told not to make this a big deal, but here I am making this a big deal. Look how high she is! <laughs> how do you feel? Fine. You can put me a hammer and a crowbar? Yes, I go get a hammer and crowbar. Okay, I'm coming up. If it shakes, don't freak out. Um, okay. Yo, that was good. You already got that off? You got them both? What? One well, off. I, I actually don't mind it up here. I'm happy to hear that. You're better at height than me. 
I get angry and I freak out, and then no one's happy. Yeah. Crystal, yeah. you should wear this to your bachelorette party this weekend. What? Show up as a construction worker? <laughs> no, show up as blue Henry. Hi, my name is Henry Blueskin. Last piece of blue skin. The girls think they're coming. I mean, they technically could go to a bachelorette. Yeah, they could. You really late for the party. Come on, dogs. I'm not. Is so, yeah. that a bag of shoes? Yep. Fun shoes? Fun shoes. I love you. Bye, honey. Have fun. I'll miss ya. Miss you too. See y'all in a bit. I love you. Love you. It is just Porter and I today, and Larry, of course, when he makes the appearances to drop more dirt, a lot of dirt. Anyways, when I heard my neighbors brought in 26 loads of fill in order to level off their area, I knew right then and there, one, we didn't have enough money year one to do that, and two, we also didn't bring enough fill in. So now we are gonna start making our way around the house, but first, we need to move that scaffolding. Why is it black? It's too hot to go on that black roof anyways. Hey everyone, this is what Porter and I do when the boss isn't around. We chit and chat. Yeah, Here we are. We bad. just stand there, we've literally been standing on the stage know, and just talking. talking. Story after story after story. Yeah, let's uh... Okay, I'm gonna duct tape my mouth. Okay, watch, the, watch the oh, wind. Look at us go. Yeah, thank you, babe. Cool enough. Yeah. That's wet. Mm. Oh, that does feel nice. Back to her. Look at that berry, y'all. The raspberries are coming in so nice. All right, those are chanterelle mushrooms. A neighbor just came over and asked if I wanted some. They're out harvesting right now. And apparently this year, compared to last summer because it's been so wet, there are an abundance of chanterelles. And the reason the neighbor came over wasn't just to give me some mushrooms, but an important package came in the mail. Starlink! Our Starlink got hit by lightning. I'm so excited. I should set this up right now, to be honest. coffee no just these things thank you prime i know it might just look like a bunch of dirt to you all right now but it seriously is so much more than dirt and fill it is everything we have been waiting so long to do this with the weather not cooperating and to it finally being sunny enough to do everything has dried out that we can do it and thank you to porter and larry for switching up their schedule and coming on over to help us out. He's making it flush against the sauna tube so you don't see that concrete. Crystal's at a bachelorette party and I wanted to surprise her with what I'm about to build. She's been wanting to do this forever. I've been seeing these designs on TikTok and I think they look nice. The biggest decision of the night, where to put these. Even harder decision, because Crystal's in here. After cleaning up the old conjure queen and cement blocks from last year, Clementine meets Kitty Cat on the playing field, and teamwork went a long way. Okay. Is that straight? Is it straight? Oh my gosh, tomato plant's so happy. Crystal should be home in a couple days, and then we're both off on a plane. See you all in two weeks. Miss you, love you, sing it, Bella. <laughs>